What's up guys, back in the gym. I've been working out in my garage lately trying to get ready for this next contest. But please like and subscribe to this channel before we begin because it really helps me out. Like I've always said, the more followers and likes I get, the more products I can bring to you guys to talk about. So guys, I'm going to be talking about this product that I just picked up, which is called Rock Sauce, which you're wondering, what the heck is Rock Sauce? Rock Sauce is from the people that brought you rock tape. So you see CrossFitters and a bunch of other athletes that have tape like on their shoulders, all that stuff and this and here and that. Sometimes they use the brand called Rock Tape, which is a huge name brand stuff. They brought you this, which is a muscle pain reliever cream that you roll on. Same thing as like a biofreeze, if you know what I'm talking about. This stuff is a little bit different than from biofreeze because biofreeze, when you put it on, you get this like cool sensation, almost like it feels like it's burning, but it's really cooling, which hurts. Kind of like when you go outside and you play in the snow a little bit and you get that little burn sensation. That's kind of like what biofreeze is. This though is actually just straight up heat. This has capsaicin in it, which if you don't know what capsaicin is, if you ever heard of pepper spray, that's full of capsaicin. So when you're putting this on, make sure you keep your hands the heck away from any of it. Because if it gets in your eyes, mouth, or whatever, it's going to burn, okay? So, you know, like hot sauces, the higher amount of capsaicin levels and all that shit that's in that stuff, because capsaicin is a type of pepper which is really, really hot. Typically, most hot sauces have capsaicin in it. It's going to burn like freaking crazy. And if you've ever been pepper sprayed, you don't want that. I've been pepper sprayed. It's horrible. Don't recommend it. Either way, I just put this stuff on probably like maybe five minutes ago. And I'm already starting to feel it. It is a little burn. I mean, it's not crazy. The only problem with these, because I've had the Biofreeze roll on and this roll on now. Biofreeze tends to go on a little bit like clearer when you roll it on. It's not as messy. This seems to be more of a creamy. So you leaves this like white residue stuff. So you gotta be really cautious about that. Especially when you see that, you might wanna rub that in. Don't do that. And if you do, use lots of cold, cold water. Don't use hot water, because hot water will just activate that capsaicin and you'll be burning all day. Now, when to use this stuff. I typically use it before I work out because it takes me a while now, since I'm a little bit older, to warm up and stuff. And especially if I'm like short on time, I might try to roll this stuff on on certain areas to help me warm up a little bit better and to keep my muscles loose and ready to go and generally get rid of nagging pains that might hinder my workout. Especially for competitions and stuff, it works great. Some people might want to use it afterwards. Eh, I mean, you can do that. I don't recommend this because this kind of lasts a while. So like after a workout, I guess if you have to like, you know, get in the car and go home that's like further away or you just want to be able to actually, you know, walk out of a competition, then fine. But I highly recommend just using it before. I probably use Biofreeze after because it has the cooling stuff. Um, where can you find this stuff? You can find this stuff at like most healthcare providers like um, chiropractors, hand massage therapists, that type of stuff. You can find it in stores. It might be a hit or miss. Biofreeze is usually more typical in stores, but I'm pretty sure you can find this, especially in like sports stores, like Dick's Sporting Goods and stuff. Um, 
Yeah, I'm starting to feel it more, a little bit more. So, highly recommend this. Check it out. And also, for legal purposes, be sure to check with your healthcare provider, doctor, whoever, before using this in case you do have a sensitivity to capsaicin. You don't want to, you know, risk your health using this stuff. So, please check with them before using. And also, please like and subscribe.